So Vince, what, what role does CGC play in the comic book and rare comic book collecting industry? Well, we're a uh, third party independent grading service. Uh, the value of a comic book is based on its condition, as most collectibles are. And uh, for example, a Spider-Man number one uh, can be anywhere from $1,000 to a $1 million, depending on uh, how many rips, tears, and creases are on it. Uh, so in order to uh, uh, facilitate uh, uh, a, 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 a value with uh, customers uh, and owners of a comic book, uh, if they want to sell their book, uh, they have to establish a condition. And uh, that's where we come in. We uh, grade your comic book, we uh, authenticate it, we search for any defects, any types of repairs. Uh, restoration, of course, is uh, uh, done on books uh, and paper quite often, and so we search for that. And we let the owner of the comic book know what, he, what it is he owns. Uh, once he's got a grade, uh, established grade, then you can look into price guides and you can get an established value. Once you've got your established value, you're out there in the world uh, with your uh, collectible or your investment, and uh, you can, uh, and people will deal with you uh, because they've got confidence in us and uh, that we've done our job properly to uh, guarantee that that book is uh, the grade it's in. That's why we're comic book guarantee company. So, um, for generations, comic books have been marketed to a wide audience of readers, from youngsters to adults. But the phenomenon of comic books being investment grade or, or collectible in the sense of uh, condition uh, being important is more relatively uh, something that's come about in the last several decades. So what are the steps that a professional grader has to keep in mind when evaluating a vintage comic book? Uh, well, that's where we, we try and uh, just stay completely uh, nonpartisan to it and stay independent from it. We take each book as it is. So what are some of the criteria you're looking for for a quality comic book? Uh, a lack of tears, a lack of stains, a lack of creases, uh, uh, all the pages there. Uh, brittleness, we look for the page quality. That goes on the uh, label also to let you know if your book is uh, turning brittle or fragile. Uh, so you've uh, got a good idea of what's uh, inside that plastic case when we hand you your book back.